Hey guys, it's me, Bowser64. Thanks for joining me for another video. Today we're going to be playing Bricks of Egypt. It's an Arkanoid style game. If you're really familiar with the breakout style games, we have this big paddle going back and forth and all that good stuff like pew, 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 pew. It's awesome. So you just hit, well, that's so Pong. That's definitely not Arkanoid. Arkanoid is this. So here's your wall and you got your paddle going up and down like this. Boop. Oh, you get the idea. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to describe it. You gotta see it to believe it. It's awesome. Okay, so Arkanoid style games, they're kind of hard to find. I mean, good ones are. You know, uh, there's tons of them out there that say, Yes, Arkanoid style game! It's amazing! But then you start playing it and it's like, um, I'm spending my time on this? Like, why? I don't feel changed inside. I don't feel moved or emotionally connected to this game or this experience. So yeah, it's it, it's it's awesome. It's called Bricks of Egypt. It came out in around, uh, well you're about to see when I boot the game up, but it's a really fun game and I've been wanting to cover this for a long time. It was hard for me to find it again so I could play it because it's like really old now. But it's really fun and we're going to play it. So here we go. <coughs> Welcome to YouTube. I make videos. Put our headphones on. We gotta put the hair behind the ears first. All right, all righty, smelts. All righty, all righty. We're getting started. It's what we're doing. All right, so we are here now on our desktop, and we're gonna go ahead and open up bricks of Egypt. And sorry about the really reduced screen resolution, guys. It's the only way I can get the little tiny window to go full screen almost. So that's the way it is. Plus, you can jam to it. It's awesome. Okay. Bricks of Egypt, guys. It's awesome. 2004-2007 Arcade Lab. Great game. I've turned this down. I can't hear myself think. It's so fun because it's there's so many awesome levels. Like, look at this. You get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight level packs. That's awesome, right? So we're gonna go ahead and start with the Tutankhamun. We're gonna keep it easy, cause we are easy schmeasy. And uh, I can't get it to go. I don't understand. Oh, there we go. Okay. So like I said, it's an Arkanoid style game. Uh, let's turn the microphone off before we just completely destroy all our audio for the rest of the entire recording. Um, right, off, off, go off now. Okay, so yes, Arkanoid style games, they're kind of hard to find. A really good one was Ricochet, which we will also be covering in a later video as well. It's kind of along the same, same year that this was released. And it's a really fun game, too, with lots of effects when you blow up the blocks and stuff like that. And this one is really cool because you got items and stuff. You can shoot blocks, and you can just melt stuff away. And there's a whole bunch of different ways to play levels. It doesn't really get old that fast because it's really fun. So here we go. I don't hear any audio. Do you? I remember this. I remember we have to get out and... There we go. Like, what? Slow I got no audio. Slow down. So as you can see, you got jewels to collect, and obviously the idea of the whole game, it's sticky. I love the stuff it says. We're gonna blow this up! So we got like super laser awesomeness right now, and we're just gonna totally smash the world apart. Yay! Three balls on the screen! <laughs> this is awesome, right? So that's level one, now we're in level two, because I didn't have any any time to wait. Um, I think that I, 
that was probably a good thing I should have gotten that, but I thought I was gonna like, no, I'm gonna die! I don't wanna die! I can't get this very mysterious item I can't understand. I must be afraid of it. See, that's kind of cool, it like hits that. Going down. So all those bo bombs are connected and, and all those blocks are, uh, so they're in like a chain. When you hit one, it blows up the rest of them. It's pretty cool. Because you can uh, have really interesting levels with with all that in mind. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> Sometimes it gets slow because it's just hitting the ball back and forth and there's no music whatsoever, except like really Slowly randomly down. and not all the time, so. Yeah, treasure, treasure! Yay! Yay, laser, we can go faster! Oh! Oh, dang it! Why did that happen? I didn't even see that. See, it's like, that's what's hard about this game. Is you're firing and trying to break all the blocks away, and then all of a sudden your ball is gone, and you don't understand where it went, because you weren't following your ball around the screen. And then, when it's gone, it's gone, and it's tough to be you. So, you gotta keep your eye on the ball, kind of like foosball, and soccer ball, and baseball, and ping pong ball, and all that good stuff, you know what I'm saying? Alright, let's do this. Let's do this, I want to get- dang it. Why did that happen? I was watching! Ugh. Okay, that was stupid. That was like my own fault. I was like, I'm gonna like move the mouse to the left now and totally like mess up the entire level. <laughs> it's unbelievable, man. Sticky. I surprised myself. Sticky. So that what you can kind of see the items are self-explanatory that you get. I got this sticky thing and it, it gives my uh, paddle spikes so it keeps my ball adhered to it. And I can kind of aim where I want the ball to go, which is kind of convenient. But other than that, um... I mean, this this game's really fun, and it's easy to catch on to, easy to pick up and play. And uh, I, I don't, you might not notice this, but a lot of the games nowadays are super complicated just to get started in. And it's nice to have something like this to choose from that you can just kind of do whatever you want. It's, it's a very casual game, is what I would call it. Multi ball. Multi ball, yay! I only have two left. Oh no, there's fire from heaven. Yay! Die, 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 die! This is awesome. Watch this. Watch this. Multi ball. This is crazy. No! Oh my god. I can't believe we actually survived that. That's like amazing. <laughs> there is so much happening. I have no idea. Whoa! Death. Must not get the death. Death button. Da -na 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 -na. All right, here we are, dude. We lost our laser awesomeness, like shooter thingy. But I don't know. I don't know what that eye does at all. I've never been able to figure that out. Those eyes are just like kind of just going around the screen. And other than like dripping tears or acid to break some blocks for you, they don't really do a whole bunch. Yay! Jars of money! Oh, nice. I like that. Um, I don't like that, though. I kind of wanted to keep my ball longer than that. <laughs> you never know, man. Never know. It's like, whatever. Okay, this is kind of lame. There we go. <laughs> Sometimes your ball will just keep going up and down in the same fashion, and after a, after a while... You just have to wait for it to, like, start going the other way to where it's going to come out where you can hit it and hit it and direct it towards another block. Because if you don't, it's, like, going to take you forever to get through a level. And sometimes it'll take you forever anyway because they're really challenging levels. These are easy, but they get a lot harder, trust me. Da -na -na, na -na -na. Yay, sticky, sticky! So as you can see that box with the that block with the key on it in the upper left hand corner of the screen whenever you hit it it locks um, it turns those invisible blocks on and then you can kind of have a whole fun thing going on inside there I can't talk right now 
I don't know what it is. Today is not my day. See what I'm saying? It stayed in there a while, and the only way it could come out is if it had its own, like, AI to come out and do other stuff. Yep, turn it off. Yay! So, you probably wonder, there, there was like a couple blocks left, but I still progress in the level. The reason that works is because those little sandstone blocks, the ones that have all the cracks in them, those don't really count as real blocks, apparent, but apparently. And so if you hit those, and uh, it's great, I mean, you get some points, but the ones they really care about you getting are the hard ones that crack, like when you hit them. Sticky. So... I don't know if that made any sense at all, but whatever. Dun, 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 dun. Fire! And death. Yes. Alright, guys, give a hand for death! Woo! I died again! That's so twisted, man. Oh, dude. That's just like. Give a hand, cause I suck! Sticky. Yeah, you don't want to get that. That's death in the jar right there. Yes, yes, yes. Don't go... Oh, really? Okay. I want to go over here, though. Yay, item! Woohoo! Slowing down. Woohoo! Slowing down. Fire from heaven! More fire from heaven! Yay! Channel. Oh yeah, now we got the laser awesome shooter thing. Nice. <laughs> Level six. We are getting it done, dude. We are getting it done. I wish my screen recorder had a time counter, but it does not. So therefore, we have to stand up. Ah, we have three minutes left. Lucky us. We are going to go destroy this level, because that is what we do. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but whatever. Sticky. Yay! It makes fun noises. Oh, apparently if you click it all the time, it goes away real fast. That's kind of lame. Dun dun dun! Come on. Get up there. Get up there, I know you can do it. I know you can do it. Slowing down. Yes, yeah, slowing down. Dun 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 dun. Na, 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 na. We need some like epic, awesome, like classical music going on. Oh well. Dun dun dun. <laughs> it just goes through, like whatever. Like this is the last thing keeping me from winning. It's like bloop, you won. Congratulations. Now, try the lottery. Oh my gosh! That's why it sucks to have a really small paddle, guys. Alright, I guess that's it. Thanks for watching, everyone. This has been Bowser in 64 playing Bricks of Egypt. It's amazing. You should check it out. 2004 to 2007 is when it was released. And it's a really fun game. Arkanoid style game. So check it out. You will not be disappointed. Trust me. It seems simple. But, trust me, when you play it, it's a lot more fun than it looks. So, and hopefully it looks fun, too. But, thanks for watching, guys. If you liked this video, hit the like button. Don't hit the hit subscribe button. Stay updated for all my future videos and releases. And, if you want to stay updated release by release or video by video of new thing I upload, hit the bell icon by the subscribe button, and then you will get a notification for every single new thing I do on YouTube. How awesome is that? Whoa! Okay, so... Yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I will see you around with another video. Have a great day.